So I heard you want to beat the Lost Sector fast. Let me now, I'll be running this Lost Sector with a very in-depth build that I made a whole video on previously. I'll briefly describe the build after I show you the location of today's Lost Sector. The exotic armor in rotation today is Boots. Today we'll be clearing with just one class, but there are builds for all three classes in the description. And with that out of the way, what's good guys, it's Zen, thanks for choosing my channel, and let's hop right into today's guide. Now for today's Lost Sector, we're going to have to deal with Unstoppable and Overload Champions, and with that in mind, we're going to be using my Shinobu's Vow build with a Hand Cannon, Cold Heart, and a Machine Gun. Now the Hand Cannon is here due to its stunning Unstoppable Champions, Cold Heart is here due to its heavy build synergy and heavy damage, also the fact that it stuns overload champions this season the machine gun is here again due to that heavy build synergy and the fact that it does some crazy damage to bosses and champions due to osmosis allowing it to take advantage of the arc surge lasting all season now guys there is literally so much going on with this build it would take too long to explain it i can't explain it in this short video but we're talking about literally infinite grenades like i will throw two grenades and i'll have them back up five seconds later you'll see what i mean in this gameplay but i highly recommend and watching the build video you guys are not going to want to miss out on this it will not be as good after the season ends but with that being said let's hop right into the guide all right so the first thing we're going to do when we enter this lost sector is throw our grenade very very fitting for the build that we are running here we do have the infinite grenades and you see i just threw a grenade and my grenade is already back up but this isn't a build video so let's go into the commentary you see there's the unstoppable abomination now what we just did is obviously we're going to stun it and start being it, beaming it with our machine gun now keep in mind this machine gun is actually osmosis, so it becomes arc when we switch over. Now, if you guys don't have this machine gun and you're interested in trying out this build, just go to the tower. You can go buy it from the exotic kiosk. It's actually a seasonal pursuit weapon from a previous season. Now, as you can see, there's going to be a ton of screams jumping up on you. Just be aware of them, guys. You see where they're spawning. Now, there's going to be a couple more waves of unstoppables, and we're going to have to deal with an overload, and there's a sniper. I'm going to point all that out as we get to it but i just wanted you to be aware of what we need to deal with in this i don't want to call it a room but that's kind of what it is it, like we're outside but <laughs> in this section of the lost sector that's what we need to deal with now this is one of the best lost sectors to farm if you are running this build i mean we are getting four minute clears on what is typically not the easiest lost sector this build just absolutely trivializes it it really shines here just due to the nature of the things that lengthen it which is just adds this is perfect ad clear so we are just making quick work of it now after you deal with that second unstoppable you're going to want to deal with this sniper immediately because he beca he can be quite annoying if you don't kill him now you see we're able to absolutely fry him now we're going to start dealing with this overload champion so what we're going to do is stun him with the cold heart switch to the well we're not switching we're just going to throw our grenades there to get a bit of ad clear going on now keep in mind guys and another unstoppable champion is going to spawn, so you don't want to just be mindlessly dealing with this overload, not being aware that another unstoppable is going to spawn from the left side, from the same position that the previous unstoppable was at. Now we did throw a grenade there because we saw the animation for ad spawning, but it seems that if you kill the overload before those ads spawn, they actually just never spawn, which is very interesting. Now there's more screams to deal with. I'm just going to throw a grenade that just killed like eight nine different ads for us and now you see there's another unstoppable and it's going to be the same thing we're going to switch to our machine gun throw a grenade to get the osmosis going now the benefit of that is obviously there's an arc season there's an arc surge lasting all season for 25 percent damage bonus on that machine gun which is absolutely excellent gonna switch to the hand cannon stun him boom and then we're just gonna melt him really really easy stuff guys we just cleared this in two minutes and 40 seconds now obviously not the whole lost sector but i'm saying this section this section here is definitely the longest part of the lost sector and the final room the boss room is just so damn easy guys and you'll see that in a second so we're gonna proceed forward all right now the second you enter this boss room you're gonna want to break these because if an enemy breaks them you're pretty much gonna die they do extremely heavy damage for some reason now we're gonna have to deal with some of these ads so we're gonna throw our grenades as usual <laughs> gonna throw another grenade we just threw a grenade and we already have one fully charged like if you guys i i really recommend checking out that build video because this is the most fun i've had playing destiny in such a long time when i invented this so so much fun guys now we're just gonna melt this overload champion really really easy stuff guys it's absolutely falling over because of the cold heart excellent excellent gun now at this point there's gonna be a couple more ads that spawn and after we deal with them 
then the boss is actually going to spawn and we are going to absolutely melt the boss you'll see in a second how quickly the boss just absolutely falls over now 350 we only have like a couple seconds left in the run here so that is going to be the boss spawning on the left side we can't see him yet because he's shy today you know he he had a bad dream he's not feeling too good today but there he is he showed his face now we're just going to throw our super here and you'll see the boss's health just absolutely get deleted look at this boss's health absolutely insane stuff this this build is just so damn good guys especially this season with the artifact merds with with the arc surge i mean it's just insane we just cleared this lost sector so this is an easy easy farm today guys if you are running this build and that's going to be the guide guys hopefully this helped if it did be sure to subscribe as i post lost sector guides daily either way i appreciate you watching and i'll see you tomorrow for the next video peace